antivirus or VPN? This is a wrong question as these two do completely different things. To make things clear, let me compare VPN versus antivirus for you, showing all the differences that lie between these cybersecurity apps. To understand what is the difference between VPN and antivirus, you must know how both operate. Antiviruses are easier to understand. The best antivirus software scans your device, all of its processes, and even the incoming information from the internet for signs of malware, malicious files, or code of any sort. If a threat is detected, it's isolated and often purged, keeping your device safe in the process. You can think of it as hiring guards of your device. They will check inside and outside as well as all entrances to ensure security. How secure are VPNs in comparison? This, my friends, is also a wrong question since VPNs do not build walls to protect you. On the contrary, they act as the convoy of your data. By employing tunneling protocols, VPNs surround all incoming and outcoming information with layers of encryption. This protects your data from tampering and nobody outside of the VPN providers can access your connection. Furthermore, the convoy passes through guard posts VPN servers. So even if someone decides to track the encrypted data, they can't get any further than the VPN server. So if your provider is reputable, this boosts your privacy a lot. You can already see the answer for is VPN the same as antivirus and it's a no. Antivirus and VPN use completely different approaches. One focused on setting up an impregnable fourth of your data and other by establishing a secure route of it. I personally prefer to take the first step and protect myself online before the malicious effects can even reach me. So I use a VPN. If you wanna try the best VPNs and antivirus options yourself, I will leave exclusive discounts for the most secure VPN providers in the description of this video. But I get it, maybe you don't wanna hurry. Now let's get to the pressing question. Between VPN versus antivirus, which one is better? Unfortunately, they are really not comparable. You saw it yourself, both software do different things, but I can show you in which cases it's better to choose antivirus or VPN to fix the issue. For instance, let's say you wanna avoid getting tracked online. Setting up a home defense won't help. You need an armed convoy, so a VPN would be much better for that case. If you wanna prevent malware infestations, even VPNs with anti-malware capabilities will not provide the same level of security as antivirus would. But in case you need a safe access to restricted online content like the geo-blocked streaming platforms, yes, a VPN would be amazing for that. Same can be said if you are looking for anonymity. Since your connection will become privatized after passing through the VPN server, it will be really hard to pinpoint your online activity. This is the power of internet security that is VPN. Antivirus, on the other hand, can protect you from forms of danger which don't need your identity. Phishing emails, for instance, can't be countered by a VPN. Antiviruses, however, can detect and block fake phishing websites, giving you a chance for salvation. Same can be said about dealing with existing malware infestations. Antivirus will serve as the guard that purges the invader, while VPN won't even notice the invasion. What does this VPN versus antivirus difference mean for you as the user? Well, there's just one thing really. Neither VPN nor antivirus can provide you a 100% degree of protection. Now, using them in conjunction is a different matter entirely. I believe it's the only way you can actually get close to being safe. That said, there exists antiviruses with built-in VPNs, and for instance, Surfshark VPN has a proprietary antivirus you can get with it. However, even the best antivirus with VPN or VPN with antivirus will not be as good as two separate services. Focus on just doing one thing. So I would recommend setting your eyes on full-fledged VPN or antivirus apps because half measures tend to give out in the most critical moments. Still, if you'd like to get your tools from one provider, which is usually a smart step, you can get Surfshark VPN with antivirus or some other VPNs with anti-malware capabilities through the link in the description. Heck, I'll even throw in an exclusive discount if that'll help you boost your security. I guess that concludes this VPN versus antivirus 2022 comparison. Let me know in the comments your thoughts on VPNs and antiviruses. Which do you think is more crucial to have and why? 
I'm glad you watched so far and I hope I will see you again in the next video.